Wagner introduces the revolutionary Smart Flow Roller. Fast, smooth, even painting of walls and ceilings is easy with a Smart Flow Roller. Paint trays, paint buckets, and left behind paint drips become a distant memory. Now you can finish your painting projects twice as fast and get a professional looking paint job every time. The Smart Flow Roller is compatible with all latex and oil based paints. It's easy to use and easy to clean, and simply gets your job done right. With the Smart Flow Roller, there's no need to go back and forth to a paint tray. The paint's in the handle and the control at your fingertips, delivering smooth, even coverage for a uniform roller finish. Perfect for walls and ceilings, the Smart Flow Roller gets the job done quickly. Wagner's innovative Smart Flow Roller makes painting projects quick and easy. The Smart Flow Roller is easy to set up following a few simple steps. First, open the carton and remove the plunger assembly and batteries. Open the battery door and insert four AA batteries. Insert the plunger into the paint reservoir. Then tighten the locking collar, making sure the battery door is trapped under it. Next, attach the roller cover assembly to the roller arm. It should firmly click in place and spin freely. Then, attach the roller arm by squeezing the quick release tabs on the reservoir and snap into place. To fill the Smart Flow roller, insert the fill tube into the lid and snap the lid over your can of paint. Flip the side lever to power and then firmly press the fill valve onto the tube until it stops. For faster filling, you can switch to manual and draw back the plunger. Use the quick touch control and reverse the plunger to begin filling the reservoir. Release the button when the reservoir is full. Next, load the roller by pressing the quick touch control button forward. Release the button when you see paint coming through the roller cover. As a reminder, when painting ceilings, use the adjustable spatter guard. Simply snap it into place over the roller cover and rotate it into position to catch any drips when painting overhead. Now you're ready to paint. Before starting any painting project, it's a good idea to protect your floors and anything else you don't want accidentally painted. Remember to first cut in around base, windows, and door trim for the best results. Begin rolling to evenly distribute the paint. Press the quick touch control to feed paint to the roller and keep it saturated. A saturated roller allows you to keep a wet edge for the most even finish. However, do not oversaturate the roller. This can cause the roller to drip, slip, and slide on the wall. Start painting at one end of the wall. Work your way across in three foot by three foot sections. Finish your sections by painting one solid sweep from ceiling to floor for the most even finish. Refill the reservoir with paint as needed. The Smart Flow Roller allows you to cover up to 70 square feet in one fill. For best results, we recommend that you finish painting the entire wall or stop at a doorway or corner before taking a break. This will help prevent an uneven finish and lap marks. Cover the roller with a plastic bag while taking a break to prevent it from drying out. The Smart Flow Roller allows you to complete your painting project faster with less mess and a more even finish. When you're finished painting, simply press the quick touch control to reverse the remaining paint into the reservoir. Then press the fill valve back onto the fill tube and press the quick touch control forward to push the paint back into the container. Warm soapy water is ideal for cleanup if you used latex based paint. Be sure to see your owner's manual for oil based paint cleanup instructions. Remove the roller cover assembly by pressing the locking tab to release it. Remove the roller cap and push the roller core out of the roller cover for cleaning. Do not throw these parts away. To clean the rest of the Smart Flow roller, flip the side lever to Manual. Remove the fill tube from the paint can lid and insert it into the valve housing. 
Submerge the fill tube into warm, soapy water and pull the plunger in and out until it's clean. Remove the fill tube and submerge the fill valve and roller arm in the water and pull the plunger in and out to clean the roller arm. Remove the roller arm. Submerge the head of the smart flow roller and the fill valve and pull the plunger in and out to clean the valve. If you've not done so already, clean the remaining parts by hand. In order to keep your roller in great working condition, some of its internal parts should be cleaned and lubricated before storage. Unscrew the locking collar and pull out the plunger assembly. Lubricate the O-rings and reinsert the plunger into the reservoir tube, tightening and locking the collar securely. Tips and instructions can be found in the storage section of your user's manual. In just a few simple steps, your SmartFlow roller is now clean. To learn more about your SmartFlow roller, visit wagnerspraytech.com.